quickly, please. What is this to us? What about this one? What about this? So, without that, you struggle. Remember, we are just revising a current equation. Why do I have to do this? Because I need to come here. As you can see, I put what? David M. So you need to know your account equation. But remember I said before when we dealt with account equation, we did not have the third account. We always had what? The two. But now because we are bad vendors, we need to make sure that we have what what? The two accounts together with that. Please check the movement for me. Help me. And again, so I this responsibility to know the movement. Guys, keep quiet, please. Give me the sides. Debit. David. Credit. Credit. Debit. David. Again, I expect you to know those things. There is no shortcut here, guys. Unfortunately, you need to know your rules. Remember, test number two, accounting equation can still be what? Given to you. So you cannot say I'm going to focus on only point five. No? Everything. Yesterday, what did I say about recording? I said, which accounts must be recorded first? The accounts which have been debited must always be recorded. First, write it down, guys, otherwise you're going to forget. And I'm going to remind you and I'm going to feel bad. Okay. I repeat, the accounts which have been debited will always be recorded first. So which account must I record first if you check me? I'm going to record the vehicle. Is there any other debit? Which is what? Uh, input that. Input that. Remember, I record the first two accounts first. Can you see this? Because they have been what? Debited. Debited this one. Eh? Which one did I create? Check. Which one must be credited? Um, capital. How did I say you must record capital? When I was a little bit. Can you see now? Don't put them in. So I'll write what? What? Because it shows that it's going to the credit. Don't put them in line. Only the accounts on the debit must be put in line. Okay. The one that goes to the credit side must always be taken a little bit further to show that it's going to the credit side. Not. What you say? One line means. On the yeah, it must be on the shelf, but everything is which is every phone line like that. Yes. The amounts, I'm going to have how many amounts? One, two, three amounts because that's what how many accounts? Three. But you need to master this. You are if you are wrong here, forget about that. So that's why you need to know your account equation very, very well. Folios, I think by now you know what can I write here? Which, I'm writing B. B stands for girl B. Eh? True or false? What does B stand Balance. 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 Sheet. Not sheet. Sheet. Okay. <laughs> what about this one? B. B. What about this one? B. B. Remember. Balance sheet section only consists of three groups, namely assets, owner's equities, and liabilities. Incomes and expenses will go under which section? Nominal account section. That's why you're going to have what? M instead of what? B. Are we together? Thank you, guys. I know, I know, it's just a don't feel bad. Don't feel demoted. Okay. Now, the only thing that I'm left with here is to record the amount. What is the amount for the contribution that they are thinking about there? Give me the amount there. 
six, eight. Um, the the amount sorry, given to you? Seven, seven, six, two, two, comma, five, zero. Six, two, two, two comma, five, zero. This is the amount of the contribution. Can you all see that? Guys, you don't have a question paper, forget about it. I'm spending. I don't want to lie. <laughs> I'm telling you, people are still paying with the question paper. So if you don't have it, share with a friend for now. I think they won't mind, okay? Because I can see some of you have having that skill of looking at me. I'll show you. Right, please, make sure that you put a question paper. Now, what do you call this? What is the main thing here? Out of these three accounts, which account do you think is the biggest of them all? Capital. So meaning capital is the main account between this account. Why do you have to know the main account? Because the total amount will be absorbed by what? The main account. So it's important. Otherwise, you are going to put the amount in line with what? The wrong account. Do you understand? So where will I put this amount? In line with what? Capital. Because capital is the main account. So I'm going to come here. Remember I said I must pay it what? I must come here and say 776221. Can you see? The importance of knowing the main account. The main account will always have the amount inclusive of what? Yes. But now you need to make sure that you find the bed for me and you find what? The vehicle for me. Remember, I said I prefer you to start calculating one. I said you must always try to start with the amount for bed. Please calculate bed, and the amount of bed is included already. I trust you can do that. So that is nine five. Nine five. Okay, let's. And now we said seven. Nine five. Three two. Yes. Comma five nine. And that means that the vehicle is six eight. Six eight. Six eight zero eight. Six eight zero eight. Nine, comma nine one. Please understand. Yeah. Who can tell me how do we calculate this bed like you did before? You said this amount times forging over. Why am I using forging over one and four? Because it's inclusive of bed. Don't forget that guy. That's why we had to learn bed before. Remember. Now we're using it. So if you calculate, I'm telling you, you won't be surprised which amount are you going to find. So this calculation will give you which amount? This amount, I promise you. It's the difference between the two, you know. Yeah. Yes. I don't know if I gave you the other before. Yes. So now. Any question about this? So how can we find this? You just take this amount minus what? Don't say I didn't tell you. Very easy. That's why I want you to start with what? That. Because the minute you find that, it's obvious you'll know what the other amount. I repeat. You will take the amount including that to minus what? Less. Less what? Help me. Are you tired, guys? Or yeah. have you started the weekend already? <laughs> I repeat, you take the amount, you less, you get the amount without that. Any question? <laughs> yes. Okay, that one I can give you. Who else needs that one? Okay. Let's take one and pass, and then I'll give you more. Okay. Who else wants the sorry? Okay. I mean, the, 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 the,
Are we okay? Now, sorry, let's focus, let's focus. I like attention, guys, I like attention. Yesterday I said, sometimes they can ask you to have a brief description of what happened. What do we call that? Hmm? Yesterday, I said, sometimes they can ask you to write a reason why you have this. In short, oh, yes. what do we call it uh, yesterday? But you remember I said that? Yes. It was around 10 past? It was 25 uh, to 10. Yeah. Yes, I remember, no, brother. No, no, no. Yes. Uh, 25 to 11. Oh, it was 25 to 10. What do we call it? I'm going to tell you for the last time. Because the next time I'll be marking your text. Okay. If they ask you to write a short description of what happened, we call that a narration. Write it down. Narration. Narration. To narrate. Hmm? Those who want to talk like that. Narration. So, in short, what can we say in short here? What happened? You can look at the transition. The vehicle uh, contributed by the owner. The vehicle contributed uh, oh, well, Ray, by the yeah. <laughs> owner. This is what you can do. Remember, there is no formula. You can summarize in your own ways, okay? As long as it makes sense. Don't write so best idea. It won't make sense. I'm not part of the transaction. Read and summarize. But guys, to be honest with you, sometimes in the exam, because of time, they say ignore it. narration. Meaning you wanted to show this thing. Okay. But if they don't tell you to ignore, please don't ignore. Because by ignoring it means you're ignoring what? But that will indicate if you must do it or not. That one. They will always tell. Okay. But if they don't say anything, do it. Okay. Ah, guys, I can see you feel bored. Man, let's go to the next one. The date? Yeah. On the 20th. Yeah. JV266. Two six? Six. Are we okay? So because of space, I'm going to remove this. You can take a picture if you wanna. But can I? Okay. So what day is our test next week? When yes, we will talk about that. Remind me after this. Because we need to write a test. No. Did you submit the assignment, guys? Uh, At least it gave it to the twenty six. Okay. When? So guys, don't lose three months. Be silent. The task. So, so we have four guys. Can you tell me, guys? That's not actually. Okay. Can you talk about this after this? But yeah, but I, I remember I told you I'm going to see the eyes. What was she doing? She was. We have the eyes. Right. Now, what is important is this at the moment. Whether you did the ice class or not, it's just the situation. Now, let's go to Read the next one, please. Read the transaction in question. I'm waiting and I want my waiting. Can you please read the next transaction, which is on the train here? Here we paid how much? We paid man five check. Yeah. Give me the amount that we paid this twenty eight thousand. Seven hundred eighty-nine point five six. This is the payment we made, but luckily we have been given discount of how much? Five percent. Remember, you need to be careful here. This is what you paid. This means what you paid is equivalent to how many percent? Because if you paid this amount and they gave you 5% discount, meaning you paid 95% of what you owe. 
But the challenge is what? I need to know my discount. Let me ask you something. Where must we record this 2878? Which book? There are about eight of them. Where are we going to record that 28789? Think about it. Transaction and check, check rate. Where are we going to record it? Don't memorize, understand. Read the transaction here. So where do we record that kind of a transaction? But which book, which journal? Cash payments. Cash payments. What is that? See? I foresee danger, guys. You don't even understand that I paid. When I pay cash, I always record under what? Listen up. You need to fix that. Because in the test, you need to read and understand. You go to the wrong book, no marks. You understand me? So because I paid, this will go to what? CVP. But now remember, my main focus is what? Because discounts must go to what? Is that right? So when you pay your account and they give you the discount, you must always go to what? That's why they even gave me JB. This is about what? Discount. How are you today? Please do not make mistakes. Now, for me to know 5%, I need to know the original amount. Is this the original account amount? No. So, I need to know the 100%. How can I go back to 100%? I will say 2, 8, 7, 8, 9. How will I do that? You will divide by what? 95%. This will be your amount before discount. Does that make sense? Please use your advanced calculator to find the answer for me. So the answer is 30. 30. 30. 30. 4. 4. 80. 80. Let me put here. The answer is 30. 30. 4. 80. This is what? The original amount. Which is what? Meaning the account that I was supposed to pay was how much? They only said I must pay how much? That amount. So what is the discount? It's easy now. I can find the discount. Just minus five. You can take this and minus. Or you can say. Thank you very much. Times 5%. How much do you get? 1, 5, 1, 5, when? 3, 0. So it doesn't matter, guys. It's either you take this one, you minus that, or you just say 5%. You must get the same. Be careful, guys. Can you see sometimes when you read, you can make a mistake. Man. Some of you should have could have said 2878 eight, times what? Be careful. If this was the account owed, the amount owed, yes, I would agree with you. But this is what you paid. It's equivalent to? You must know how to go back. Divide. Are we okay, guys? So now I found the amount that I've been looking for. Are we together? Now, the challenge is, we need to know the accounts involved. And you are going to help me with those accounts. Guys, you need to think first. <laughs> Don't just say, I've seen this before. No, 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 you can't change. When you read this information, try to give me the account involved. Guys, I need space, I'm going to remove this. Can I? No, I say, why about now, give me the account involved, please. Because you have been given the discount. Who can give you the discount? Only? Can you see that? If you were the one who was giving discount, you were supposed to write what? Data. So you need to be careful. 
But what did the creditor give you? What is that? Or we can call it what? Settlement discount or discount receipt. Are we together? The question is, is there any vet implications on this? Think about it carefully. You are paying creditors. Remember, before you can pay them, you owe them. Before you can owe them, you bought from them. How? On account. No, 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 account. On account. Yeah? No vet on the payment. I only pay them. Can you see that? It's what I meant. Let me give you a situation. Before you can owe this person, it means you bought from them. On credit. They charge you vet how much? 40%. But what do you call that vet that they charged you when you bought from them? They are two types. Vet, you know? Kind of mm vet or mm vet man. I repeat my statement because I'm for the whole day. When you buy from creditors, they charge you vet. What is the vet that you have been charged? Input vet. We agree on that. So that input vet will be playing bankrupt SAS. But the minute they give you the discount, it means that discount has got part of the output. That was I was supposed to claim back from. SARS cannot allow you to claim input on the discount receipt. Never. So you need to reverse it. So the minute you are given discount, forget about that input on the discount. So you call it input. How can I reverse it? Out. Does that make sense? Okay, I'm trying to explain because some of you I can see from your facial expression, you are going to be lecturers in the future. So you need to know how to explain. But it's a way of learning it like an exam technique. Write it down. It's not... It's a fact, obviously. Discount receipt always go with output bet. It's a fact, but I don't memorize it. Eh? I explain. <coughs> Write it down. Discount received go with what? Output bet. Are you writing that down? Settlement, discount, received, always go with what? Output, bet. So, meaning if it was a data, mm -hmm. it was going to go with input bet. Yes, and that discount would be settlement, discount, transit. Yes. So, it would be, write it down, settlement, discount, granted, will go with what? Input. But I don't want you to memorize, unfortunately. That's why I explain why do we do that. We are reversing the input. So, settlement is count receipt, meaning the other account is going to be what? Output? Yeah. It will never change. Yes. Settlement is count? The other one is settlement is count. What is the opposite? Uh -huh. Settlement discount granted is the other one. There are two settlement discount granted. Settlement discount granted. I'm not talking about this one. What is the opposite of this? Settlement discount granted. So if you have that one, it will go with what? Input bet. So there was after the discount discount output bet. That one is missing. Remember, I'm talking about the settlement discount. Yes. The vet will be what? Output. In future, it can change. And it becomes what? Settlement discount? Granted. It will go with what? Input. But I'll come to that one. For now, let's focus on this one. <laughs> no, 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 not like that. Not literally. Okay. Okay, stop to me, Helena. Guys, I know GJ has got problems. I think some of you can attest to that. Because you need to analyze. Ah, talk to me. Otherwise, if you don't talk to me, I won't continue. And there's no break. I'm serious. So talk to me. Say hi. 
It's a liability, all agree in agreement. And what is this? What is this? Income. Sure, guys. You know how to disappoint, eh? What about this? Ah, uh, guys, thank you. Let's go and practice. Sure, sure, guys. Be honest. You know, sometimes I have like the study at home. I'm just like, like just checking this book, colorful book. Or oh, you want to surprise me with high marks? I can't wait. Let's divide. Okay, movement. <clears throat> Let's show the movement. Help me with the movement. Will the liabilities increase or decrease? Because if they give you the discount, you owe less. What about the settlement discount received? Income, will they increase or decrease? Because they gave me an income in the form of what? Discount. What about the liabilities output? Can I tell you something? According to our system that we are using, eh? Whenever you see VET output or input, né? always put an arrow that goes out. Did you hear what I said? Yes. Whenever you see output or input, you always go out. It's because of the system that you are using. You don't memorize. That is an exam technique. Because it's either you are selling something and you are charging customers. And customers will pay you what? Output VET. So you owe sales more. Or it's either you are reversing what? The input. For you to reverse the input, what must you do? You increase what? The output. I promise you, you won't find an error that goes down in the exam. But that is just an exam technique. What if in the exam they say, today we write the exam and you just tell us, before you write something, you tell us why. You stand up. What are you going to say? Whenever you see output, it must go up. They will ask you why. Thank you. <laughs> Sides. This one? What about it? Just go and practice. Just imagine others are singing about this, but you don't even understand why are they singing. It's because they understand. Okay. No, guys, I'm not looking at anyone. Eh? But a guilty party will always be guilty. <laughs> okay. Nah. Can we record, please? I think you know how to record now. You tell me, and then I will interfere if there's uh, a problem. So, what must I? How can I read it? It's debited. Remember, you always start with the one that you did, it, okay? And then what is the next one? Uh, a statement or something. I mean, sorry, settlement or something. Debit or credit? How do I read it? Sorry? How do I read it? Here. Nah. Here, yeah, in, in detail. Here, yeah. here, no, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm just saying this. You can't be. Oh, shut up. Do you want to? What else? Must I record? I'll put where must I record it? In line with this one. You are going to find that table. That 49.5 is a pass. Why? 49.5 is a pass. You are not sure. I'm pretty sure. Exactly. You're aiming just for 49.5. Follow, please. Follow. Be here. What about this? What about this? Thank you. Are we okay? Okay, now you know how we roll. Which, which amount are we trying to record here? Which amount? Uh -huh. That goes to the CVP. Uh, 
the amount that you are equal in here. Who shall not see? Just come one five. 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 One People can hurt you, eh? <laughs> it's okay, but now you know. The reason why I came here, I can only record discount receipt here or discount benefit. So the payment will go to us. The 3030 that you are talking about, forget about it, okay? You can't record it. Because you separated that. Né? This part goes to, and that part goes to. When you add them together, they go back to 303. Now you want to record 303 here in your dreams. <laughs> but we know now. We know now. Okay. okay. Don't worry about my eyes. I can see your body. Don't worry about it. <laughs> now. Uh, don't worry my child. Show me. Which one will absorb the whole amount? Which one is the main thing here? Like me in this class. Who is the main guy in this class? It's me. So, who is going to absorb everything? Cages. Cages absorb everything. This is the one who gave me. And now we start my side for that. One, five, one, five, where? Do what you do best. Here, I think you can show off here. Show off. I want the amount, the remaining time. I said you must start calculating. Mm. Don't tell me. Between the two, you can choose, doesn't matter. As long as the answers are correct. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Yeah, I'll go back to it. Mm -hmm. No, remember there are two. I want to know which amount is the remaining and which one is that. One by one. One by one, you put it there, so it can be. How much is that? Two. Oh, yeah. Two. Eight. Guys, can I say something? How did you find those amounts? It's the same way. Oh, so. Ah, yeah. come on. Yeah. 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 One one four. Different. Check one one. I mean fourteen over one one two. One eight six comma zero eight. One eight six. Comma eight zero eight. Zero eight. Guys, find this amount. Find this amount. One eight nine. Is the discount the same? One. Sorry. Sorry. Which amount? How much is this one? One three two nine. One two. One three two nine. Comma one. Uh, thank you. Yeah. If you don't understand, you'll ask. Guys, hold on. Hold on. I'm waiting. No, this thing. Check. So what is the point of of dealing with it? This one. Yeah. It's because of how would I find this one? Oh, yeah. So I just wanted to find this one and I went with it. And how did I find this one, guys? Just easy like VC as you can see. Can you see now? Times this by over. Oh, come on, guys. And then you get this. How did I find this? This minus yeah. Let's go back. 
Here, this amount. You don't know how we found it. This. What's up, man? No. Yes. Okay. Sorry, guys. This is what you owe. Ne? When they give you the discount, do you owe the same amount? No. So you owe less. That's why the error is going. And where do liabilities decrease? On the daily side. Are you okay? This one. The output vert is the vert that must be paid to size. Remember, I'm reversing the input. For me to reverse the input, I must increase what? The output. It's true. So, for example, let's say you have got input eh, of 100 and output of 20. And you want to decrease this by what? By 10. You don't have to come and minus here. You can just go and add how much? If you add 10 here, automatically you decrease what? The input. So when we go to SARS, remember we compare the two things. We say how much the input and how much is what? So the minute I increase this one, it means I decrease this. So this will always go up at the end. Are you okay? Thank you very much. Any other question, guys? Guys, you cannot postpone questions. That is a very dangerous exercise. Okay. Yeah, if they ask you to for CDP, you will go and record. But if they didn't ask you, like in this case, you don't have CDP. We can. So, it doesn't, how do you know that it's up to that? It doesn't say anything. You must know and say if someone is giving me the discount. When I bought from him before, what was the thing uh, they did there? The a bad code, it was called input. But now I'm reversing what the input because I forgot discount. Yeah, so you must know the initial process and you do the opposite. And then obviously you know for pillars, you know it's computer's control because you owe. Because yeah, because yeah. only creators can give you what the discount. Yeah, because you owe them. Mm. Got it? Mm. Are we together? Guys, what can be the narration in short? But I don't need it, but I'm just saying what can be the narration in short. What can you say here in your own way? Even in your own language, you just count this. This counts as so Yes, from you can even code the source, it doesn't matter. Okay, it's short. But I don't need it now because I don't have time for that. Are we together? Um, 1981, Yes. Drawings or inventions. I think we have seen this before under account equation. Okay, it doesn't change anything. It's just that now we have got what we call the vet implication. That's the only difference. Okay, just give me the account for now. I know you, you know the account. Drawings. Drawings is the first one. Thank you very much. The other one is trading inventory because we are using which system? Which system are we using? Uh, I don't know. Okay. Guys, come on. If you say trading inventory, you must know which system. Okay. Perpetual. And if, if it was purely, you do venture system. Guys, you must project. Like, I must hear what you are saying. You said purchase system. Eh? So, do you understand the difference? If you don't understand, please consult the book. Okay. So, why do you like making so much of that? Like what? You're making so much of the wrong. No, no, no. I'm just looking at you so you can change your answer. <laughs> it's okay. But is there any bad implication? Yeah. You're going to ask on the drawings. Yes. Can you see for you to, to know, you must check before it was drawings, it means I bought it before. When I bought, was there any bad implications? When I was buying inventory? <laughs> when you buy inventory, is there any bad? Yes. Now, when you bought inventory, what was the bet that they charged you? The vet, not the vet amount. I'm talking about the vet charge. Guys, it's input. It's, it's input vet. 
So I think you are selling it. Remember, I told you that when you buy, you always pay what? When you sell, you charge? So why are you hesitant? So you say, buy it is input. The one that is paid by you is input. The one that is paid by the customers is what? Output. So my question is, here I bought inventory, which I bought before. When I bought inventory, which bed did I pay? Input. But now that inventory, I take it off. All news. I must reverse it. I will call it. So, write it as your additional notes, drawings, and output verbs. Same water proof. Can I repeat? Drawings and output verbs always go together. So, don't make a mistake in the exam. Eh? You know now. Now, can I continue or do you have any questions? No. Classify for me quickly. Owner's equity. What is this? What is this? Remember, guys, don't take this for granted. Help me with the arrows. Up. What about this? Don't guess, guys, be sure. And then? Ah, you said it always goes up. Perfect. I like the fact that you remember this. Guys, you need to understand why. In the exam, you cannot say, let me try. <laughs> no, you can't say no. <laughs> Make me sure. Why drawings? Okay, the more goods you take, the more drawings you have. That's how you go up. But you took stock from the business. Why did you do the stock? <laughs> Just imagine you take stock, but the stock increases. Hey, the hawks will come. How do you take the inventory and the inventory increases? Oh, you are running a, a, a certain business. Eh? Very illegal. Now, obvious. Size. David size. David size. Credit. I don't fire that. I trust you. Okay, help me here. Now you know, you know I'm just writing and I'm happy. Draw it. Draw it. What else? Trading. Talk to me if you're lost. Obviously, we two people is from that. Are we okay? Okay, guys, just for the sake of. Showing off. Can B F D. B. B. What about this? What about this? What about this? What is this? Check there. Okay. How much is the drawings amount given to you? Give me that figure. One thousand? Nine hundred and eighty-one. Eight? Nine. Thank you. I remember, guys. Very well. That week. Around quarter to nine. Maybe you remember it was around quarter to nine, and then yeah, I think it was around uh, March. My birthday month. I talked about the drawings of stock. I said the drawings of stock must always be X fill in the missing figures or missing weights. Write it down for the seventieth time. Write it down. On that day when they said drawings of stock must always be at the costs. Drawings of stock must always be at the cost. Can you see the examiner is trying to be very, very, very clever here? They gave you what? 
selling pride. Is this the cost? This is the selling? But we never ever use the selling price on the joint of stock. stock ne? And you, a woman of your caliber, know how to convert this selling price to cost. Calculate for me, don't ask me how. We said one, two. I'll wait. I'll use this as a benchmark. My brother said the cost is this. But I'll wait for you to try. Calculate. You know, don't you say that you don't you know how to calculate the cost of sales. You know very well. You know. So we use the selling card, it's coming the markup that's given. this or you can call it what? So on the on the third chair, the first third chair. Okay. Check there guys, there's someone who's owing us and we decided to write them off. Uh, what does that mean? It means we lost this money. So the amount you write off, what is to write off? Because some people write off oh, people and then they say no, I don't want you anymore. Right? Reach out. Then you can't. So maybe you cancel it then. So if you cancel a debt or some uh, the money that is being owed to you, we call this what? Credit loss or you choose. But I can only write off someone who owes me. Ne? What do I call someone who owes me? Can you see that? So you write off a debt. You can't write off a creditor. A creditor must write you off. The question is, is there any vet implication? Think about the original stage. There is. Why? Because by the time when we sold to debtors, we were calculating what? Vet. So, if I cancel a debtor, it means there's a vet in the game. But let's check this. When I was selling to debtors, which vet do we calculate? Output. Now we are canceling them. We need to reverse. We call it what? Write it down. When I see bad debt as debtors, Sorry. When I see bad debt, I'm always thinking of what? Input bet. Write it down. Bad debt and input bet. No use. So you see, bad debt or credit losses go with input bet. That's my extra note. So next time you know which bet to identify. As long as you see what? You must think of. <laughs> max, 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 max. So please, only the practice will help us. Are we okay? Help me. Help me. What is this to us? Expense. What about this? What about this? Is that thing called? No, <laughs> it's okay. I'm just reminding you. This one? Can go up. What? Expenses increase. I've got more expenses. What about this one? If I cancel someone, do they still owe me? So? This must be obvious. I told you. I mean, after Thank you. Don't waste time. Don't waste time. Sir, sir, cancel the Then, yeah, if you owe me 500 and I cancel a debt of 500, you owe me zero now. I don't, I don't, you don't owe me any more. But you still lost. Yeah, but that's how we wrote this. To show that we lost. Can you see? Size, please. David? David? Huh? I just had it. <laughs> I said pay. Ah. 
Yeah, we're there, I did. It's okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Have we? Bad days, no? And then? Input. Input. Remember the David first. Input. Best. Okay, guys. Remember the David first, and then obviously, just like that. You right? Letters. Don't write yourself off, eh? You're not the best yet. Okay. What is this? B. What? It's B. It's B. B. Guys, go back to the drawing board. Practice makes a better. Do I know the amount? They said I must write off old lad, ne? They say the balance owing at the beginning was how much? 10,988 grand. So this means they are not saying you must write off that amount at the beginning. They didn't say you must write off the amount at the beginning. They said you must write off the amount owing. Can you see that? Can you see that, guys? Underline the word owing. Yes. I said highlight the amount owing and you never highlight anything. You highlight like with your eyes. Highlight. Wanna see the color? The minute they say amount owing. I don't have it. I don't have it anymore. You can get that one. <laughs> it's okay. Share for now. That was a commercial break, guys. Can we just continue? Share for now. I like you guys said the beggar, like no one has put paper there. Oh, yeah, my brother has put it paper. Okay. No, but don't worry. Don't take it. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can I continue, guys? Time, time, time. Don't worry. As long as I don't finish this, this Sunday, we don't go anywhere. Can take your time, my brother. Now, don't make noise. You must be the only one who must make noise. Can you see today? I'm very strict. Yes. Did you highlight the word owing? Yes. Why did I say you must analyze that? It's because you are going to make a mistake. Some people can just take that amount of how much? How much is the balance? Please give me the balance. 10,888 grand. Come again. 10,888 grand. 8. After 8. Yeah. 50 cents. Like this. Yeah. This is the amount at the beginning. Eh? But they didn't say you must write off the amount at the beginning. So it means. You must go back to all the information on your question. Eh? Wherever you see old luck, you must tell me. Go back. Old luck, old luck. Everywhere. Go back. For what? Old old luck. Luck. The guy we are talking about there. Check the name. Old luck. Old luck. Old luck. Are you a chicken? Yes. Remember, you can go back maybe up there or down there, maybe you can find it. How many times do you find it? Give me the first date where you found him. On the seventh. Two, two, two. 
On the second, never mind my two. What happened then? Did we sell to him or what happened? We sold, ne? Give me that sale. Do you know the amount of sale? Seventy-seven. Seven two five nine zero. Five nine. Oh, five nine zero and no cents. No cents. I will add because I sold. Remember, this was the balance at the beginning. I sold to him, so I agree. The next day, please. Where you found Oja? Is that all? How much does he owe me now? Add for me. S. You said this is the only information that you found. So the balance was this is given to you, and we sold to him for this. How much is the total? That's eight. Eight. This one. Um, four. Seven. Six. Seven. Eight. Seven. Eight. Six. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very I know because I got the information. Can you all see this balance? Guys, can you see that? Sir? So, why can I explain it to make noise? That's the question. So, I one more time. Take out your information. On number what is this one which transition? Yeah. On the third chip, yeah. yeah. JB268. They gave you the balance for old land S1088. Can you check that? Yeah. Yeah. So meaning at the beginning of this month, he owed us how much? Are you all okay? Yes. But during the period, on the second somewhere, we sold to him again for how much? Go and check the sale on the second old land. Don't you see this amount? Please check for me. So, meaning, he owes me the balance plus additional that I made. It's like you, you owe me 10 rents from yesterday. Today you say, can you please give me 10 rents? How much do you owe me? So at the beginning, the balance was this. I sold to him for how much? So all in all, he's owing me how much? Does that make sense for now? But unfortunately, you must have the information in front of you. So, this is the amount that they said I must write off. Can you see that? So, I'm going to write off how much? I'm going to cancel how much? 83478. So, that I you all the money that it brings me. Unless if they said this is specify the amount. They said if we can say like of only two rents, you can take that two But they put question mark there and they said like of the amount owing. So you cannot take only the amount given to there. You must take that other amount. Are we okay? This is the amount that I must use here. Which Item is the main account. Thank you. Is that Jesus? The main account is the Jesus. So the amount must be in line with what? How much? Eight, three, four, seven, eight. Fifty cents. Please be careful. Otherwise, if you put there, you're going to be wrong. Yeah. So the main account will be. So please find the input back for me. Do you know how to find it now? That's one zero. Yes. Two five. One. Two five one. Comma seven five. And, and find the credit losses for us. Seven three. Seven three. Two two. Six. Comment seven five.
Any question? Unfortunately, that is how it is. Okay, so you just have to master the babies. And do a word this I know GJ is always a problem. So, how you know the debt is controlled in the bank account? Because I'm writing off that debt. In most cases, debt is controlled in the main account. Like from the previous general, so remember the main account used to be debt. Yeah, but here, when you see data or creditor, just know that they are what? Main account. Yes. Yeah, if they put a question mark there and they said must write of the amount owed, then you must go back. If you find it four times, you are supposed to have four amounts there. Check whether you minus. Sometimes we minus, sometimes we add. Why did we add? It's because we sold. But sometimes you can return. If we returned, we will minus. If you paid us, we will also minus. And find what? This amount. But sir, is it necessary to minus? Can't you just give it out and add all the amounts that you didn't pay? No, remember if you minus, you owe me less. So if I cannot minus anything there, it means I'm writing off a bigger amount instead of what? A less amount. No, sir, the amount that we have. Uh, that is at the beginning of the month, right? Yeah. So can't we take any amounts that they didn't specify that you paid? And then we just write them down. I mean, the ones where we said you paid, we don't write them down. No, we must pay to show that. Remember, let's say, for example, he paid 10,000 on this one. I can't ignore that 10,000 because it's like now I'm cancelling 834 instead of what? A lesser amount. I must first minus whatever he paid. The remainder is what he owes me at the moment. I can only write off what he owes me now. So I cannot ignore the amount that we paid. So you must pay me, and I can only write off the amount that you owe me. I don't know whether it makes sense or not. Yeah, because here, unfortunately, we only have what? Say, he never returned, he never paid. So is the amount that you minus the one that he paid? Uh, the returns. And the discounts, if we have. And the creditors, guys, keep quiet so that we can understand better. Okay, so the two are going to guys, if you make noise now, we are going to go home. I promise you. Because uh, I'll need to have extra time just to relax. Highlight for me, please. I classify. What is this? It's an expense. Expense. What about this? Liability. Movement. Afternoon. What about this? Also. Because when they charge you interest, you are. This is a uh, control will increase. You owe more. Science, please. David, okay? Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. What? Why is it there? Don't you think that one account is missing? No. Which account? Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, write this down. <laughs> Interests are not bettable. Right oh, now. Remember, when we see new things, we add, yeah, okay? Whenever you see interest, guys, do not calculate that. So, this one must be the easiest one on the app. So, no bet on interest. So you want to know? Yeah. Yeah. So just two. No, that's on. So just two. Um, just two. Um, thank you. Now help me to put them here. What must I start with? Expense. Huh? The other one is. But don't put it in line. Remember? Yeah. It must look still vestige. <laughs> Thank you very much, guys. Step by step, we go. I wish we could do this account in the whole day.
Help me. N and amount. I know it's boring, guys. I'm sorry. Three or five. No sense. And I must do what? Guys, when you see this next time, just get your math center. So that's because there's no facts. This is Perfect. What is? Thank you guys. Narrations, I think I trust you. You can like your own narrations. It's okay for now. We'll just continue to that. Next one. What is the next one? So just draw it with your head for now, sorry guys. I know it's too much. Uh, is it still the same? Are we okay? It's the same thing. What are they saying here? They say interest charged by. Who are we? Thank you very much. The next one is the interest income. Perfect. And what is the other account? It's just the complete opposite of what you see on the here. We were charged. Here we are. We can only charge data. We can only be charged by what? Okay. Help me. Income. What about this? S. Movements, please. Up and up. And up. Credit and debit. Guys, remember if you have got experience, there's no need for you to do this. Then I know in the exam you're going to go direct. You trust you. Okay, <laughs> no problem. You can do that. Okay. Help me here. I start with. Just control it. Thank you. And then. Help me, for you. B and N. Thank you. And it's not because here I said N B, here I must say B and uh -uh. It's not easy. Okay, what do you think? Any bit implication? No interest on? Yes, give me the amount. No sense. So now you know when you see interest, guys, just just copy and paste. Next, Jamie two seven one. Yeah, still on the thirtieth. Eh? Okay, this one, please just try to, to analyze for me, guys. I think we can do better because we've seen something like this before. The discount granted, eh? Uh, and they refer to it somewhere, eh? So it's like similar to what we just did. Eh? So they refer to, to which such document? Go back to the DR602 somewhere there. Are you there? You're not there. You never went there. You were, you were feeling like, like this. You never went there. Eh? You should have done something like this. Are you there? Yeah. So what are they saying there? Because they refer us there. Let's read that. Hey, this one, they said we received what? 
we received from V Nelson less eight percent what? And the balance owing is what? This is just similar to what we just did. Who can try this one? Please? Just tell me what to do. I think we remember what we did, right? Same yeah. procedure. I will start with what? My balance, right? Yeah? My balance. Give me the balance first. Just, uh, at the beginning, please. Mm -hmm. At the beginning. What is the balance at the beginning? Give it to you. 13,000? 185? No sense. No. And you remember what we did before? We had to add what? No. Oh, yes. And then where do we go from here? Decide. <laughs> but you must check first. No? You can't just decide. Who is this guy? He, is this investor? No. Who is this guy? No. 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 So, oh, you just like that. Yes, thank you very much. Wherever you find another set, even under the tree, so that it's yeah, so yeah, not. Not the two because of the eight percent. No, before that we need to do some yeah, terms. So on the twenty-eighth, on the twenty-eighth, what happened? He returned. Eh? Okay, I'll write return for the sake of simplicity. Eh? So when I return, will I add or less? Minus. How much? Ninety. No sense. Thirty cents. Thank you very much. Can you see the returns we did that? Jealousy is always prevailing. Yeah. Now let's continue. Yeah. <laughs> is this the only date where you found it? No. Check no. everywhere. On the nineteenth. On the nineteenth. What happened on the nineteenth? Um, sale of trading. When we sell, are we going to add or less? Yeah. How much is the amount? Guys, it's all about understanding. Can you see that? Don't be jealous. I think they're listening. Can we continue? Any other day? No. The only day is the one that I'm on, like that one on the GR something. Right? But can you see that on the 30th day? Can you see GRC 2 Let's go back to that. When they gave it the balance owing. Can you see this balance owing? They said we received cash. In other words, he paid us. And then we received this kind of amount. 8%. So firstly, I must know how much is the amount owing at the moment. This is how we see. 70,000? 720. Point two zero. Point two zero. Yes, guys, I think you all understand. Use the calculator. Yes. yes. Balance at the beginning. Yeah, because of ink. <laughs> hey, ink is expensive, guys. No. This week, what is <laughs> The question is, do you understand what I'm talking about now? Does it come now? Does it? Yeah. Now, he owes me how much? But we gave him a discount of how much? 8%. 8%. So I'm looking for this 8%. How much is the 8%? 8% of this amount. 5, 6. 5, 6. 5, 7. 6 2. Thank you very much. That's the 8% of the 7. Right? Yes, the 8% of the 7. Guys, please verify the amount. Yeah. Got it. Can you see the process then? Eh? So people don't have to do that. For the time being, questions, please. Then you just say that one is that. No, we don't. But you get the. Because of the outlet out of this account. I need the discount only here. Okay. But if you are looking for the amount you will see, you will minus and record in the CBR. Yeah. I am, I agree with you. But here I only need what? So discount. The first the first one, right? Is you would balance the first one? At the beginning. Oh. It's given there. At the beginning. Yeah, just abbreviated, my brother. Space, no? Right? 
yeah. and the ink and everything. After was balanced. Guys, can I tell you something? Because in the exam they can ask you maybe four generals at the same time. Can you see this? What is this? The discount. Discount will always come to what? Write it down. It's not like I don't trust. Alright? But it's for future reference. Okay. Write it down. I am I'm writing it down. I'm, I'm going to give you the statement. The discounts are only recorded in the GJ. Only discount. Can you see here out of this process? I only selected which amount? Because that is the only discount that I have. But the question is. What about the other amount? The amount owing was how much? So if I say 70 minus this amount, I will know the amount that I have received. That amount must go to the CPR. Write it down. This minus this will be the amount which I received because I gave this card. That amount must be reflected in the CPR because I received it. Oh, yeah. The one that you receive always goes to the CDR. The discount always goes to what? Don't say I didn't tell you. Because, can you see the reason why I'm recording myself? It's <laughs> because in the future it will change. Any question? So don't worry about 70 minus. I'm not sure about it. I'm not recording there. I'm worried about the discount. Can we come here, please? Which account must I start with? <laughs> Do we have the account? Okay, let's check the account. No, it's another one. Let's come with the account quickly. Give me the account. Settlement. Discount granted. The other one? Data control. You said input back. Thank you, man. Remember, I gave you notes on this, no? When we started today. Yes, must put it in, brother. Thank you. I guess you must not be surprised because we have been here all along. By the way, you are not here to observe. Okay. Yes, you are the participant. I thought we knew our language. When I look at you, it means I expect something from you. Thank you. Can you see when I write here, I write with an I? Because I know you know it. Otherwise, you'll stop me. But I know sometimes I'm not approachable. You don't know how to stop me. Eh? But yeah, it's okay. Help me here, guys. How can I come in? Help me. Yes, sir. Sir, is called Gadget. <laughs> Discount, guys. Sorry, I'm just going to write sentiment DG. You know what I mean? Okay, yeah. and then what else? Mm -hmm. In line or somewhere? Mm -hmm. uh, in line. Thank you, thank you, guys. And then, obviously, where? Somewhere there. Okay. Thank you. I know, I'm happy now. I'm telling you, can you go home? Not now, by the way. After the lesson. Yeah, no. N. B. B. Thank you. We know the amount that we are looking for. Which is what? Which one is the main account? It means that amount must be in line with? Thank you. You must sing along with me, guys. I'm sorry. I'm going to put how much? Five, six, five, seven point. 
do what you do best. So I trust you. Okay. You're wrong. What is that for? Six? Nine? Four point? Are you all in agreement? Okay, find the sediment. Is this very incorrect? Okay, but how can I find DT? Same when we found others. Why do you change? Four nine. Four nine. Eight two. Eight two. Thank you very much. I believe that if you don't understand, you'll stop me, guys. No one will laugh at you, I'm telling you. It will be very heavy because some of them don't understand. You can't just write. What if at home they ask you to explain? It's okay, you are from school, and they forgot to explain. <laughs> it's okay. But at least I believe that when we see this next time, something will just click it, okay? I remember. Do you still have something left? On the, the last one, eh? JB. Sorry, guys, don't make noise. Uh, okay, I'll create space here. Any space? Okay, let's see. Okay, guys, let's continue. Let's not make noise, guys. Okay, now I understand. We are taking break parallel to the lesson. Meaning there is no break because you are taking break at the same time as we are having a lesson. I like it. We are saving time. Very cool. Now, can I go back to this one? What do you think about that one? They said, we made a mistake there. Can you see now? It was realized that the equipment bought during November was by mistake debited to us. This is the easiest thing on earth. They made a mistake, they referred in this account instead of that account. So give me those accounts. Equipment. Equipment. Yeah. The other one is? Oh, this consumables. <laughs> Guys, I think this one you understand. Yeah, correction of that. It's like for example, you are trying to go to Sylvester's house but you go to this house. <laughs> it's a mistake. Yeah. So what might you do? Fix the mistake. <laughs> so I'm just putting it back over the body. So okay, let, let, let's just analyze for the sake of revision for account equation. What is this? What is this? No problem. Okay. But first thing, you must know how is the mistake so that you can fix the mistake. To which account did we go and record by mistake? We came to the office consumable by mistake and office consumable has been what? David has said to me. Did they say that? How can I fix it? I must? Because it was debited by mistake. And I must go and debit what? This is a special case. So you must know the mistake, do the opposite to correct. How do you move out of Sylvester's house? You must just move back, like in single term of a bed. <laughs> but does this make sense? Guys, I'm going there. It's a mistake. How can I break this? Move from there. Thank you. It was a David. Uh, uh, no, I know it's, 
Is it time? No. Okay. Let's record there. Help me. So maybe I'll choose for this one. Is it a good question? Do you only have two? Okay, firstly, are these items usually better than? Yes. Even this one is better. But they did not say that there was a mistake with that. They should have told us. So now it means we must assume that the bet has been correctly accounted for. Okay. So you must wait for them to say bet is incorrect. So don't worry about it. So, <laughs> yes. If ever they gave us an amount, yeah, mm -hmm. or, let's say equipment, mm -hmm. and they see it maybe the amount was six, eight, 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 and then they said the amount that we were supposed to write in was supposed to be six, eight, which is even, yeah, which is a different amount. We're supposed to take a bigger amount of money for a smaller amount, and the amount to write in is correction of that. So it depends on that particular information. Okay. Can we record now? Remember, they said this amount, this was bought for how much? Give me the amount. Wait. Guys, this makes a difference because they say they bought it for what? This amount. And we are we know that we are bad vendors. So obviously the amount that we bought with is inclusive of what? And normally when we transfer to this account, we must take out what? It's like what we have been doing here. You see? We separate bet from the other item. So, meaning I cannot record this amount. I must record the amount excluding. Right. Yes. That's what we normally do. We separate. If I make sales, I take the bet out of what? Sales. And I separate. So, even here, I can't use this amount. You know how to calculate bet and take it off. I don't want bet. I want the amount without bet. Help me. I don't know. Okay. Eight, four, eight. That is the bed. No. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, the bed. Okay, so times fourteen over. You got eight four. Eight four zero. Yes. Comma five two. Five two, ne? Yeah. And is then that you say this amount minus what? Mm. This amount. How much you get? Remember, there are other ways of finding it, okay? 6,000 and 3. 68 and. Why Yeah. Why they This figure. Before I came here, when I checked my bank statement, in the morning something like that came in. Really? Yeah. That's what I A daily transaction. Any question? <laughs> <laughs> So, yes, I think your official expression it doesn't say what I expected from you. You have said congratulations. It was just a transition at that moment. But I didn't check since then. Just one of those. Thank you. Okay, can we record? Yes, yeah, start off the commission break. Let's check. Help me. Equipment, thank you. And obviously, Consume. office. Consume. Uh, please, what is this? Show me. B. B. Or B. N. N. Thank you. How much? Six. Six? Can you see how long does it did take us to do this thing? No. It's not difficult, just that we are seeing for the first time. So I had to <coughs> go according to the pace, okay? Alright, oh, I should have finished this. I don't know. Within six minutes. Oh. Yeah, because you didn't know it. But next time, because you know it, no. 20 minutes, right? A well record time, 10 minutes. Okay. So you can ask, you can so, practice, you can do everything. The 840, that would have been done already. Jesus. Yeah, which was already So we don't do it right now. Unless they said, they said, they said, even better. It's been incorrectly accounted for. And they must have me, they should have told me that they have been incorrectly accounted for. And they must tell me the situation at that moment. How incorrect is it? Okay? Before I can correct it. So, don't worry about the bet.
I'm afraid the card. <laughs> yes, okay, before we can decide to go, I can see you're looking at me like Bye bye. But yeah, check it. <laughs> Next week, how busy are you? I'm not busy. Very busy. Very busy. Very busy. Assignment. Yeah, we have to come here for assignment. No, I'm asking. Now, remember, it's for you. Remember that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. If you don't want to listen, guys. It's very rare in this world today to find someone who says. Please use me. Please use me. I'm available. So if you are available, I'm going to suggest, but you are not compelled by a lot of car. It's optional. Yeah. No. I wanna schedule some classes in between next week. So that we can cover whatever we wanna cover. So are we all in agreement? Yes. Sir. Yes. So check if you are available. Yes, sir. On the seventh. Let's check before. Remember it's not time up, don't take. I'm still going to decide whether to go or not now. Let, let's check first. Okay, guys, let me check first. Yes, so Okay. Hi. 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 In the morning, yes. we can take four sessions on Thursday. Yeah. Remember, four sessions yeah. is not like we can yeah. take the whole four, just to be safe. Yeah. And then, if we feel good, we can come again on Friday. We can decide on Thursday yeah. if we are going to meet one. Yeah. So, for now, guys, I'm going to ask them to send you communication, and I'm also going to send communication via PC. Yeah. I don't go. Who said you must go? I'm still talking, guys. I'm still talking. I'm still talking, eh? Now, I can see that I still have time. Can I take my time? Homework. Yes, yes, sir, yes, sir. And it is good for you to count as an ice. Yeah. The same question that we did. Can you see the same question? Eh? I want you to do the requirement on CBR. We didn't do CBR together. Oh my, maybe because this one is difficult. Eh? Can you see the one that I just gave you now? This one. This one. Yeah, this one that I just gave you. Eyes, and then you submit. When will, will I see you again? On Thursday, you bring the eyes with you. so for the test that is coming, this is part of the test. So that's why I want to see you many times before the test, so that it can be ready. Okay. Uh,
This is the eyes that you must have made when we meet. I don't know what that is. Yes. On Wednesday next week. Wednesday next week, Wednesday next week. On the second Shut guys, not on the second one. That is not the second one. Yeah, so not. Are you all now? So, 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 so,